Here's what I believe. And, and this is one of the problems I think we have right now in America in terms of money and credit and the people who have given us money. What it comes down to is this. We entered into an agreement. We made a commitment with the people. When they issued a credit card, it was very clear. We said we would make this payment to you and we would make it on this date. And that's our deal and it's a contract and we gave our word and we ought to do it no matter what. I don't care whether you have to work menial jobs to do it or whether you have to work five jobs to do it. The point is if you can keep working those jobs and make your payments, good for you. You're doing what it takes no matter what, whether you're happy, whether you feel good about it or not. However, if you can do something that is much better and leads you to other places, then you do that. But my bottom line is this, can I make my payments and pay my bills? Because your number one obligation is to the money you've already spent. Not how much money you're going to make in the future. You took on that debt willingly, unwillingly. I don't know what the circumstances is. And again, I don't care. The fact is, you said you would do it, you'd make your payments, you do what it takes no matter what to make your payments. That, so you have to answer the question for yourself. You say, can I make enough money over here to make the payments and still stay current on my bills and be able to pay and save and invest and do all those kind of things? Or do I need to go back to the other jobs? And by the way, I appreciate the fact that you said you've had several jobs and have several jobs. I appreciate that. I got people who come to me all the time and say, well, Larry, you want me to get a second job? I want you to get five jobs that what it takes to pay your bills. I don't care how hard you got to work. Right. Really, the deal you made with your creditors, why do we, that's a contract. You gave your word. I attacked a person one time and I said, you have no integrity. And they said, what do you mean I have no integrity? I'm just behind on my bills. <laughs> I'm telling you folks, that's where people's minds are right now. We've let people get to that extreme that they can't make the tie with not making your payments and not paying your bills. They don't even see that it ties in over here to a lack of integrity. You said you would do it. So it's inconvenient. I don't care. You said you would do it. Period.